Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Pomegranate Gamer, this will be our first video, I'm so excited, we're going to be playing some Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Now, I've played some Isaac beforehand, uh, some Wrath of the Lamb, uh, and that's as about as much pr previous, I guess, contact that Isaac I've had. I don't know much about Rebirth, I just started playing, it's been a day now, I've only played a few runs. I wanted to really keep much, much of the game a mystery so we could learn this together, so uh, without further ado, let's just let's just start, I guess. Let's start as Isaac. Uh, very excited. Pured this, it's been a couple of weeks, finally came out. Uh, so let's see how it plays. Um, I, I've noticed the bosses are a lot harder in this game than they've been in all the other games. Well, in, in Wrath of the Lamb at least, that's uh, what I played before this. Um, there's a bunch of new items, this is interesting, this gives you a full recharge on his spacebar slot if you pick it up, so that's pretty interesting, I'm sure that could be used to break the game, I guess. <laughs> At least uh, a lot of things in, I guess, the previous Isaac could be used to break the game. I wonder if they fixed that or if they kept some of that in. Pretty curious as to see how, how that all played out in this new, uh, this new sequel, I guess. So. Let's see, let's see where the game takes us. Okay, so we already found the boss room, so that's pretty good. This pill, uh, yeah, sure, let's take it. Tears down. Am <laughs> amazing start! Uh, okay, Larry Jr., I think. Let's see, actually, th this this familiar is actually doing... Holy crap, this familiar is doing damage. I don't know what the purple effect is. Uh, there's a small skull over it. I'm guessing it does some type of damage, I'm not exactly sure. But yeah, this boss actually went by really easily, wow. So we got toothpicks, tears, and shot speed up. Uh, not too crazy about shot speed up based off of the previous game, but maybe, I don't know, maybe it's better in this game, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, I'm gonna finish this floor, because apparently this familiar is really good. So let's just do that. Uh, okay, well, wow. <laughs> wow. Let's just see what's in the curse room, I guess. Spiders, and troll bombs. Amazing. Our tears are red too now. I don't know how. Ah, oh, toothpicks, I guess. Yeah, toothpicks. Uh, okay. Let's go down to the next floor, I guess. There's really nothing much to do here on this floor. I'm not sure if secret rooms work in the same way as in the other game. Uh, I guess we'll just have to find out. I should have probably shot those poops, but. Whatever, I guess. Basement 2. Okay. Interesting. I've noticed the freaking pathfinding, at least, I don't know if this is just me, but I noticed the pathfinding seems a lot better in this game. You can't exactly dodge enemies as easily as you can before, as you could have in the, the previous game at least. Uh, this is Sloth though. Yeah, bosses have a lot more health now, something I noticed. Uh, yeah, the little poop boss in the beginning is a pain in the ass, I'm not sure what his name is, but he's destroyed me on all of my previous runs. Uh, we don't have any keys to access that, so I'll just have to shoot some poops, I guess, and see where the game takes us. Uh, so yeah, a little bit about the channel, I guess. I've been wanting to start a YouTube channel for a while now. Whoa, serious like, slow mo suddenly. Yeah, I've been starting. I've been wanting to start a channel for a while, and uh, I don't know. I haven't really had any games that I've played that I, I thought would be interesting to, to record. I guess, but now like Rebirth came out, I figured I was gonna play it quite a bit, so. Might as well record it, see what you guys think. Uh, yeah, so, like, you know, beginning of a pretty new YouTube channel. I'd very much appreciate if you guys took the time to comment. You know, some constructive criticism always helps, I guess. Uh, know what you guys like, what you guys don't like. If you have any certain topics, I don't know why I didn't pop this. Certain topics that you guys would, like, want me to cover. Or if you'd like me to talk about the game while playing or just other stuff. Or if you'd want me to talk at all, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> So yeah, okay, so these this is like the spawn of the boss that's destroyed me all the other times. Small poop monsters. Oh my. Okay. Golden chest, but no keys. Seems like keys have been a sore so far in this run. Hopefully it'll get better as the game progresses. So yeah. Oh, okay, here we go. Mind you, with this familiar... I'm still gonna take damage, but with this familiar, it seems quite a bit easier than before. Oh boy, that was horrible. Okay, 
I think something I didn't mention is that although I did play Wrath of the Lamb, <laughs> I was quite bad at that. So, oh my. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys don't get too mad at this. Oh my. Uh, yeah, so like I said, I really want to start this fresh. I am bad now, but I, can, I think that's the magic of starting basically blind in birth with you guys that you get to see the progression that we get to we get to learn the game together I think that's pretty cool uh, oh you also gotta deal with the double okay so let's see what Satan has for us the shovel no thank you I'll take these black hearts I believe these do damage to all the enemies in the room if you take damage in the room if you take damage these black hearts in the room but I'm sorry I, I, on my screen anyways we seem to be going slow-mo in certain periods so I'm, I'm so sorry for that, I don't know what exactly is causing that, but uh, yeah, we'll try to get it fixed for next video, I guess. Try figuring out what it is. Uh, we already been to, have we been to the editor room? We have not been to the editor room. Let's see what this has in store. Okay, what is this? My little unicorn, temper, okay, so this is unicorn horn, okay. Very cool. Uh, yeah, screw it, let's go to our curse room. Uh, pills, okay. Amnesia. Not sure what that does. Amnesia. Okay. I mean, it's bad because he like face palmed when he took it. So, <laughs> so I guess we'll have to find out what that is. I'm not exactly sure. And this is tears down, so I don't want this either. Uh, let's open this, I guess. More sense. Okay. And let's go down to the next floor, I guess. Uh, I'm going to skip these little vignettes, uh, if you guys would like to see them, just comment in the video and uh, I'll just show them next time. I'm not sure, I, I know some people find them quite annoying to watch over and over again. Okay, but man, this familiar is just destroying right now. Holy, it, it's kind of like having, honestly, it's kind of like, with my accuracy, it's kind of like having a second character on the screen, a second Isaac. So, let's do that. These guys. This room does not seem so. As he takes damage, this room does not seem bad so far. Come on. Okay. Let's kill that. Let's see what this guy does. Yeah. So uh, I don't know. Like I said before, it seems like the bosses have a lot more health in this game. Enemies in general, but I'm not sure if that's just me. I have, I have no idea. Unless characters maybe shoot faster in this game, I'm, I'm not exactly sure, but they just seem to be much harder to kill. Okay. Another thing I noticed that if we break um, certain rocks, I'll actually get like a secret room hatchet going down, then there's like an item there. And that was really cool the first time I played them, that really surprised me. A really cool new aspect to the game, I guess, that they added. Uh, yeah, so far though I've been digging, based on my peer I've been really digging the new items that they've added. They seem really cool. Uh, they add a lot more, I guess, strategy to the game in a way. There's a lot more you could do now with certain effects. Uh, but I'm not going to talk about it too much. Like I said, I really want to discover this game with you guys, so we'll see what we get here and how we could use it. I mean, I'm sure some items will be our inevitable destruction, just because we have no idea what we're, do what we're doing, so uh, we'll just basically pick everything up. <laughs> without exactly knowing the effects. So that should be fun. Shut these fires. Oh, that's familiar. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Uh, is this common cold? This is common cold, yes. Okay, so... Okay. I know most of the items from uh, Wrath of the Lamb, so I feel pretty comfortable with some of them, but with the new items, with these new enemies too, with it. I don't know. Okay, so that, that other one died because we took damage from the, okay, the black heart. Okay. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, key. And the boss room, so let's see what boss we have here. We have Gertie. Is this Gertie? Oh god, this is not. Is it Gertie? I'm not sure, I kind of skipped it. Uh, what is this? Oh my. Why isn't the. Okay, the familiar has to go in. Okay. 
Okay. Sorry for not talking much during these boss fights, by the way. I'm like concentrating like really hard right now. <laughs> kind of like going to try hard mode as soon as the room starts. I don't want I don't want to die early. I mean, I'm probably not going to make it to mom this run. Like I said, I don't have much experience in this new game, but I don't want to die stupidly. Is basically my goal. Is to, to die with some type of dignity. <laughs> Whatever that means. In a game where cancer is a good thing. <laughs> so, uh... Let's kind of... Oh my. Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> well. Uh, just damage left and right. I I'm basically counting on the familiar to kill the, the boss right now. I mean... I'm gonna try sneaking. Okay, there you go. He is dead. Get a spirit heart, and what is this? Speed ball. Okay, speed and shot. Okay. Speed and. That, that's actually. That was an item from the other game, so I should have known what that was. Can I do anything fancy with this unicorn horn? I know it gives me invincibility. Uh, have we been in this room? What is this? I'm not sure if I get to that or not. It's not really worth it because I have unicorn horn, anyways, but. I'm not sure. I've been noticing all these mushrooms. I'm not sure if exactly I can break them or what have you. Okay, caves too. Let's let's go in the huge room first and just kind of get it over with. And let's uh, let's pop unicorn horn, I guess. Oh my! I noticed one thing is that these guys do not stop firing when the room ends, and this is a really bad position for me. Yup. Okay. Like I mentioned before, guys. Uh, I wouldn't be getting too mad if I were you. I mean, I'm pretty new at this game. Uh, a lot to learn still. There will be a lot of dumb damage throughout these first few. I mean, probably throughout the entire series, let's face it, but... I don't know. Uh, for me, Isaac is really part of the adventure. You're gonna die a lot of the times, but... The synergies that are made and the times that are had... Outweigh all the negatives. The very frustrating neg negatives, should I add. Uh... So let's kill all of these. I, mean, I think these are called silkworms, I'm not exactly sure. Okay. Uh, I'll go to the curse room after the boss, just because I want to keep this spirit heart. Because if it, this is anything like... Um, oh man. I'm at a loss for words here. Once again, I'm concentrating so hard on this room. Uh, <laughs> if this is anything like Wrath of the Lamb, uh, spirit hearts will not count as damage when it comes to a deal with the devil, so I have a higher chance of getting one if I don't take red heart damage. So I'm gonna base a lot of my decisions off of the previous game in Rebirth. At least until I learn how it actually all works. I've been trying my best not to look up any of the new items or any of the new uh, like effects or synergies or how anything works. Cause I really want to learn this together with the audience. I feel like it'll be an exciting adventure together so. I've been trying not to like ruin the game for myself basically. I cannot tell my familiar from the heads right now. Because this actually has not been so bad, this room. Okay. Let's go. I think there was a blue one at one point. I'm not sure if that was the poison. Or if that was the, the kind of purplish effect that my familiar gives them. But if there was a blue one, I probably should have killed them last. At least according to the other game. Because that would... Wow. That would have given me like an attack fly. Or at least a chance of getting one. But... I guess you win some... <laughs> You win some and you lose some. So, let's just kill these, these, like, deformed creatures over here. Uh, okay. Up to the next rooms now, wow. Up to the next rooms now, let's see what's in our item room. A uh, black bean, toot on touch. Okay, uh, so this is again in the other game. Whenever an enemy hits me, I'll fart. Wow, okay, just like that, I'll fart. <laughs> wow, that was like perfect. I will fart and damage enemies around me via, I think it's poison damage. And there it goes again. Wow. Okay. I am terrible at fast enemies. I simply do not possess the reaction time needed to dodge some of these things. So, let's take all this poop out, let's go to this room, okay. 
See, I can see how a lot of these rooms will actually be like extremely easy with flying, which is this room. I mean, this one's still pretty easy without flying, but if this was any other enemy, I, I probably would have had a much harder time with it. 13 cents. If we get two more cents, we'll be able to go to the shop, confidently at least. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. Let's take the keys. Holy. Just don't die to these things. Just do not die. Okay. I don't know why I'm not using the unicorn horn more often. I could have taken so much less damage. That was risky. I could have taken so much less damage with it. Okay, let's go to this. Yeah, let's just pop this, honestly, right away. Okay. 15 cents. Okay, nice. Let's go to the shop and see what that has to offer. If it's greed, it could very well kill me. I will go into the shop knowing this. Nuns habit. Okay, that's pretty nice, actually. Let's see if nuns habit. Okay, let's take out the fires. Uh, should we go to the boss? There is there is health here. Careful for these guys. Pick up the health. Uh, God. Actually, I'll, I'll actually do it. I will do it. Uh, hopefully we'll not die. Ah, uh, that's so risky. I have like this dilemma right now. Should I go to the curse room? It could have spirit hearts and those black hearts which would be really helpful. What's in here? Nothing, okay. Oh man. I have a small crown in this room. God, this is tedious. Uh, okay, because that's just the right... Okay, so that does not... Does it display that there's an item in the room? I'm not sure. Okay, let's go down to... Uh, yeah, let's go down to our boss. I'm not going to really risk it with the cursed room right now. Could end up basically killing me. Uh, chub. Oh god. Actually, it may not be so bad at this familiar. Okay, that was horrible. But, <laughs> but the chub itself may not be so bad at this familiar, especially considering we have a few bombs. Oh god. Oh god, I'm sorry. <laughs> well, guys, that was... Uh, I'm not sure. I guess anticlimactic in many ways. But, uh, yeah, that was our first run. I hope you enjoyed. Um, like I said, like favorite and subscribe if you like this kind of content uh i very much appreciate considering this is my first video if you guys would leave comments in the video uh some constructive criticism tell me what i'm what i'm doing wrongly what what you like or what you don't like more importantly i think what i could improve so yeah thank you guys for taking the time to watch my video and uh have a great day